The battle between ladybug versus Asian beetle is common among farmers who are trying to distinguish one from the other. They may both look similar, but one helps you while the other is an unwanted insect. So how do you tell these two apart? Most people definitely know what ladybugs look like. But some cannot tell the difference between the harmless ladybug and the Asian lady beetle. What you may not know is that the disguise is not perfect. By figuring out how big it is, you are able to eliminate the bad and keep the good. What's the difference between ladybug versus Asian beetle? Both are a species of lady beetle, but they carry some differences that are noticeable. They include Ladybugs Native ladybugs primarily feed on aphids. Do not bite. Don't seek warm shelter in winter. Have bright reddish-orange or red forewings. They have 13 or fewer spots on the forewings. Asian beetle Eat aphids and other pests including a native ladybug. They bite and leave a smelly liquid that affects people who have allergies or asthma. Invade warm homes during winter. They gather in groups on brightly colored windows or surfaces. They have two white lines that meet behind the head to form an M or W. Have many colors ranging from yellow, red-orange, or black. Has many spot patterns. Which is better for the garden, ladybug versus Asian beetle? Both insects are predators to aphids that destroy vegetables, flowers, and fruits. But the native ladybug is the only insect that is beneficial. It only eats soft bodies plant pests like insect eggs or aphids that are laid on leaves. This ladybug is collected and sold as natural pest control for gardeners. Asian lady beetles eat aphids as well as the native ladybug species. It also infests fall fruit like raspberries, apples, and grapes. How can you attract the right native ladybug to your farm? Stop breaking the leaves on your farm. Ladybugs prefer the leaf litter even in winter, unlike the Asian beetle that goes for your warm house. Destroy the Asian beetle when you spot them. This creates a safe environment for the ladybug to thrive and reproduce. How to handle Asian beetle infestation. There is no quick fix for the Asian beetle invasion. You can contact a professional exterminator for expert guidance. In the meantime, you may use a few creative ways to keep them under control. Use a water hose or a vacuum cleaner. When you notice clusters of Asian beetle, spray them off with a garden hose before they increase or get inside your house. If they are already inside your house, don't squash them, they leave a terrible smell. Use a vacuum cleaner to keep them under control. Seal your house inside out. It's not possible to seal your home entirely. But you can seal up cracks and crevices to make it harder or the Asian beetle to get in. Clear all vegetation. Be sure your landscaping has not overgrown. Asian beetles dwell in overgrown landscapes during the warm season. If trees hang over the roof, they increase the chance of infestation during the fall season. Conclusion Now that you can tell the difference between the two bugs, go ahead and attract the right ones and drop the bad ones. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.